वेलकम फ्रेंड टू आवर प्रैक्टिकल वर्क्स ऑन प्रिवेंटिव शटडाउन मेंटेनेंस ऑफ कंट्रोल वाल्व कंट्रोल वाल्व हैविंग मेड सो इंटेलिजेंस स्मार्ट न्यूमेट्रिक पोजीशन फर्स्ट वी विल गिव द डिटेल्स ऑफ आवर कंट्रोल वाल्व इट्स मेक इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन कंपनी लिमिटेड इट स्टॉक लेंथ 32 एमएम एंड रिक्वायर्ड एयर प्रेशर 0.421.2 kg per semi square whenever we'll go to the any kind of preventive maintenance job of control valve first we have to need the clean up air parts so we re remove the cover of filters through allen key you are seeing friend parallelly we will discuss and details of AFR. AFR having a pressure gauge, you are seeing that pressure gauge show the output pressure of AFR. You are seeing the how to remove the filter parts and parallelly you oiling the feedback mechanism of control valve. If there is a any obstruction after oiling it obstructions removed and it will operate smoothly there will be no problem in operator now we are removing the cover for getting the filter parts you are seeing that this is the filter parts this filter parts has micron spore through this spore you are passing fury you are passing through this micron holes you are seeing that and also you are seeing how to cleaning the filter parts through instrument here you are seeing friend this filter filter clean the ears and unwanted dirty parts and puri purify the air that clean air sent to the diaphragm of the control valve so there will be no problem occur in during the operation of the control valve parallelly friend you are seeing the filter assembly also we are cleaning through the instrument here and how to cleaning the afr how to open the afr you are totally seeing on during preventive maintenance jobs if you see my video you can easily handle and you can easily solve and do the preventive job there will be no problem and after cleaning the filter you rem remounting the filter part of AFR and we cover up the cover part of the filter you are seeing friend this is our first job of preventive maintenance job this is the first job the first we have to clean the AFR, then oiling the mechanism, feedback mechanism and next we will go to the positional maintenance. Positional maintenance we have to see the terminal tightness or not. We have to auto clear parallelly if there is any threshold part after all auto auto calibration it will be a smooth operate so after removing the cover of the positioner we will see the display part this is called LUI -E LUI means local user interface and right side you are seeing that red yellow wire this wire called command wire 4 to 20 milliam loop current and mix yellow and green and blue parts is to feedback wire through this wire feedback going to the DCS system now position are having two gauge one input pressure gauge and other output pressure gauge for its main key features are it can perform rotary and linear valve it is reliable and robust design. It is easy of use. Language has available English, Germany, French. It can operate local and remote. And the main advantage is that 
give it your self diagnostic features. Guided startup offers very fast view of most critical parameter of this controller. The guided startup is entered by pressing C and enter simultaneously. When we simultaneously press, we enter the guided startup configuration. V types means verb type, A types means actuator type, PFA means positional field actions, ROT means valve operation directions, I mean rotation directions, and valve AO means valve head angle. This is the main features of guided startup. Now you are seeing one by one we go. This is the cal function in the display, the blinking auto cal. If you if you twin we again enter and cal run blinking in display, it means auto calibration is going on and actuator of the valve you are seeing the gradually movement. It will take several time almost five minutes in our display cal run continuous blinking and also we are watching actuator of control valve continuous up and down is going on this up and down continuous going on and check by the positioner in auto calibration mode you are seeing again down again up the, there is being checked by the Metsu position. How Metsu position are work and internally? How the part are there? What is the part of the what is the part of the function? I will discuss. At least you can understand how Metsu position are work. Now we have a slide. In this slide, main function block is that. LUI, local user interface, my MOC, mu C means microcontroller, alpha is the position sensor, APS is full positional position sensor. This is the four parts. Working principle is that microcontroller read the input signal, positional signals, pressure sensor signals, spool signals. A difference between input signal and positional sensor measured but detected by the control algorithm inside the microcontroller. Then microcontroller calculate new, new value and send to the I2P sensor and I2P sensor change the pressure of the spool valve and reduce the pilot and valve of the actuator move in new position side of the actuator. The increasing pressure will move the diaphragm position Pistons, an actuator and feedback set, rotation clockwise, position sensor alpha measure the rotation of the rotation for the microcontroller. Microcontroller using the control algorithm modulates I2P converter until new position of the actuator according to input signal is reached. That process is will continue. This is the main fundamental theme of the Metso positioner friend it is easy you if you have a knowledge this kind of concept you can able to do the preventive job and you can do and attend the troubleshoot there will be no problem you are watching friend auto calibration is continuous going on also this kind of Metso positioner has reliability, product reliability. It is designed to offer it hertz environment characteristics. It is rugged modular design. It is excellent temperature characteristics. Vibrations impact tolerance very good. IP66 enclosure property is made. It protect against humidity, maintenance free operations. It is resistance to dirty air, wear resistant and seal components. It is contactless position measurements. This is the product reliability chart of this Metso positioner.
also you are seeing the gradually actuator of valve is down it is checked by mezzo positioner it will take several time already i told you friend there are many models already i have discussed so friend during preventive time job you have to take the several time in auto calibration mode if you want to the manual auto calibration according to chart a guide startup you have to follow then you can enter then you see friend again half of the actuator and can run message continuous blinking whenever complete the session of auto calibration successful messages can come in display screen at that time you can understand your session completed until this time you have to wait and watch you know there are many model of mezzo positioner here heart communication model is being used in this control valve mezzo positioner needs 1.5 to 2.5 air pressure supply kg per semi square mezzo also need 4 to 20 million loop current mezzo need feedback positioner 24 volt supply mezzo need two pressure gauges one for input pressure gauges and another for output pressure gauges you are seeing that also you are watching the auto calibrations continuous going on friend this is the main part friend if you watching my video please share my video at least everybody can learn this video because this video is a learning period in initial conditions those are friend initially work in industry that video help to do the preventive jobs thank you for watching my video you are seeing that it successful message in coming in my display you understand the auto calibration completed after complete the auto calibration in our preventive jobs positioner over up properly auto calibration successful thank you for watching my video and for stay the last time of the video for watching thank you friend next time i will intimate details of the mezzo positioner i try to give you stay and subscribe my channel this is our instrument team you are seeing friend thank you thank you thank you friend thank you